And we've made it! The main control unit. And this is the Scourge of the Divine Beast for Meta, Wind Blight Ganon. Good luck. That thing is one of Ganon's own, and it plays dirty. He defeated me 100 years ago, but only because I was winging it. I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but you must avenge me, Link. Okay, now, let's see here. When Wind Blight Ganon stands at ground level, usually or at least Torian will move slowly, this cannot be blocked, so your best bet is to sprint away from it. Next to this. Okay. Get on. Watch yourself. So what is your what is so what's the best bet against uh, In terms of offensive moves. Okay, so best so according to this, um, you can use arrows, okay? Okay, so what we want to do here and let let's see if we can get on these high platforms here. Oh, come on! Right, I'll take my knight's bow back. Thank you very much. Where'd it go? Oh. Oh, you're up in the sky, huh? Oh, and now you're not. Found you. All right, let's see what what do I got for healing items here. Seared steak that I'll have to do. Hardy Durlin? Okay. We'll need that. Eileen Rice? We'll take it. Okay. Okay, let's try the bomb arrows next. Wow! Okay. Bomb arrows definitely seem to work like a charm here.
go ahead in the game. Oh, there you are. There's a tornado again. Okay, full health, yet again. Second phase yet? Okay, time for phase two. Okay, now, let's see. Wind White Ganon will regularly summon four small satellites that orbit its body. You can turn all four with arrows. Okay. But how, but how am I doing on arrows? That is the question. Okay, I got no regular ones left. I got five fire, ten ice. No shock, nine bombs left. Okay. Okay, we'll have to keep the bombs and bomb arrows in play until we run out. Oh, Falcon Bow's damaged. Gotta, gotta, gotta get a... Okay, let's get the Knight's Bow out. Okay, we got one bomb arrow left. And now I'm out, so... Let's bring the Ice Arrows in play, even though this isn't Fire Blight Ganon.
Oh no, we, we are almost out of arrows. Oh, I'm down to fire arrows next. What are we doing? Wow! That was amazing! We win Blyken on the very first try! Wow! Okay, we got a heart container. Much needed one. Done. I suppose I should thank you now that my spirit is free. This returns Meadow back to its rightful owner. <laughs> Don't preen yourself just for doing your job. I do suppose you've proven your value as a warrior. A warrior worthy of my unique ability. The sacred skill that I have dubbed Ravali's Gale. It's now time to move on and start making preparations for Meadow Strike on Ganon. But only if you think you'll still need my help while you're fighting inside Hyrule Castle. Feel free to thank me now. Or never mind, just go. Your job is far from finished, you know. Princess has been waiting an awfully long time.
You'll have a precise bead on Ganon from this vantage point. And when the time is right, give him everything you've got. Now we wait for that perfect moment. <laughs> Meadow, we've been artfully patient for the last 100 years. I doubt you'll suffer a feather over a few more moments. <sighs> After all these years, I simply must admit the truth. Even without the power of flight, Link made his way to this divine beast and accomplished something that even I could not. I guess I was wrong about how lucky he would be. I hope that luck holds out, Link, for everyone's sake. Wow. I am still an on so so far out of all the blight gannets we've we have faced this is the only one that I got on my first try and it looks like I think to be fair I did have some sort of plan I did have some sort of like game plan like with like by using all those healing items and uh, and, um, uh useful points up Report to Kennelly. Okay, so we gotta go back to, uh... You have done it! And you survived at that. You conquered Divine Beast Fun Meadow. I think the beast has taken up roost at the top of the village. It looks simply divine. If the legends are true. The light from the Divine Beast will ravage the Calamity. For now, Divine Beast Von Meadow will become the protector of this village and live on in legend alongside you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, yes. I must reward you properly. Feel free to take what you find in that treasure chest. You will get more use out of it than I. What you did was miraculous, though I should expect nothing less of one from the bloodline of a champion. You were almost the equal of the very Highland champion who fought with the Master Ravali 100 years ago. All you lack is the sword that steals that seals the darkness. They say the Highland champion wielded the sword that seals the darkness that now sleeps deep within the forest. All right, so inside a great eagle bow. Okay, I'm gonna have to surrender one of my bows. And which one will it be? It will be... I'll get rid of this. All right. And with that, I think that's going to wrap it up now that we've defeat, de completed Divine Beast Fun Meadow. And until next time, this is Gold League Gamer 1. Later, folks.